Hey everyone, it's David with Chorby again today. A little bit different look, right? Don't have my normal Chorby blue on today. It's because today I'm going to do a little work in the yard. So it's a uh, the high today is going to be 80 degrees and it is time. It's March. It's time to low mow and bag. And so what I'm going to do, you can see here on my mower, um, I've got a, uh, there we go. You can see my settings. So I normally cut it at a three right here, but we're going to go all the way down to number one right there number one and pretty easy to pull it out and drop it down there we go and now we got the bagger on there to catch and we're going to go ahead and cut this down and then we'll see you here in a minute so you can see here um i forgot to take the uh, stopper out so it would mulch and uh i just made a big mess but we'll get that cleaned up in a bit but look how the difference is from where my winter height was to my low mo height quite a bit of difference and and like we've said in other videos you know the big reason for this is now you can see we'll just go side by side here how much there's not a lot of sunlight that's going to get through all of this but now you can get you can see right down to the the soil that's going to warm up a lot quicker and that's going to make our grass green up all right let's get this knocked out all right everybody all done finally so let's take a look there it is so you can see we got the whole yard knocked down. It's looking really good. You can definitely see if we get in close here, there's plenty of room for sunlight to hit that soil and warm it up. And you see all these little, see if zoom in right here, you see all this right here? This is what's called the crown of your grass. And see how it's still green even underneath all that brown? Because that's part of your grass that uh, stays alive. And uh, now we've exposed it to the sunlight and hopefully it'll wake up and it'll start growing for us. Well, I certainly hope that this has been at least somewhat educational on why we recommend mowing the yard low and bagging it uh, first cut of the spring. I've gotten all that dead material off the yard, left a good healthy crown of the grass exposed so it can be warmed up. And this is gonna give us the best chance to make sure that we get only new growth and it's not uh, stunted or held back by any of the material that was left there last year so it is a pretty labor intensive process I'm gonna let you probably hear I'm a little short of breath um, doing this so um, don't be surprised if your mower wants a little extra uh, for to bag everything up or to, to do this kind of extensive of a cleanup but it is worth the cost you only have to do it once a year and it makes a huge difference in how thick and happy your yard is so